Oh, hello there. This episode of Earthworm Jim 2 is brought to you by the Kickin' Smilodons being Smiley is Dead Blasted Heck Foundation. And now back to your regularly scheduled programming, oh god. We have nothing to be happy about, especially now that our head is inflated. Wait, that makes no sense. Jim is a little bit arrogant, but I wouldn't say that his head's inflated. I mean, you just... Oh. Well, alright, I guess that makes sense. That's what they meant. They were going for a little bit more of a literal approach. I can dig that. I can dig light bulbs in my fanny. Definitely. I can do all of that stuff. So what's going on in this level, of course, is that our head is being inflated by what can I, I can only assume is a hookah. Which is great. Always fun. And as if the light bulb... As if the light bulbs weren't enough, we have Evil the Cat impeding our way. Just pretend that orchestra of farts was, like, awesome commentary, and we'll just move along with our lives. We won't ask questions. This is not the time for that. This is the time for inflating and deflating our head with our thumb. Cartoons never lie. So Evil was supposed to keep popping out of that one. It seems he's a tricky kitty. I like that. I like that in a kitty. Alright, let's just, uh... Alright, there's a mealworm up here. I could... Oh, hey, now. I could have done that a lot more gracefully. With a little finesse, you know, like some of this. Could have done that. But you know what? No. I have a light bulb fetish. And I need to touch them. I need to touch them all. Let's get this orb here. Let's just a uh, ascend as quickly as possible. Cats with pea shooters, man. It's the worst thing since sliced bread. Yeah, man, everyone's just riding the jock strap of sliced bread. It's not that great, okay? I've had better things. Have you tried bologna? It's quite delicious. Oh, this is just awful. Alright, let's deflate really quickly before he realizes that I have not been killed. It's one thing. That's evil's one downfall. He doesn't really check to see that his work has been finished. I am just taking all types of damage here today. Alright, get that wheel, that mealworm that is not a wheel at all. Alright, so now Evil's got a new trick in his book. In his book of tricks. He doesn't have a bag of tricks, he's a cat. And I don't know if you've been around too much, but cats aren't a big fan of bags. They're usually getting put into them and sold on the black market for fur and other sorts of things. Oh, don't do this to me. These tight corners are the worst, because he doesn't really go for where you're gonna be, he goes for where you are. So the best thing to do is to dodge out of the way right at the last second, perhaps collect a 1-up. That was impossible, Evil. You can't be in two places at once, unless your real name is Schrodinger, and that seems highly unlikely. Alright, I'm just gonna go up now. Evil can hit you, just as long as he doesn't hit your head, you're fine. Let's get out of here. Light bulb technology, don't fail me now. Because that would be incredibly unfortunate. Finally, a use for these mealworms. Not quite as exciting as the quiz show, but you know, you, you get what you pay for. I suppose I should jump on this thing and punch something. Alright, so the timing is a little bit stupid. There, I got a thing. How awesome am I? The prizes don't really seem all that good either. Seem kind of stupid. That was too early. That was too late. That one didn't even go up. This is a good use of mealworms here. Yeah, alright. Moving on to the bigger fair here. That was not what was advertised. Well, that was amazing. I'm glad I, I'm glad I was a part of that. Honestly, I do. Nothing brings me greater joy. Absolutely nothing! Next time on Earthworm Jim 2. Well done. Promptness.